Who's the leader of the club that's made for you and me? M-I-C-K-E-Y-M-O-U-S-E. Yay! This is the wonderful world of Disney Week. And we're going to have two activities that have to do with Disney. Well, actually one, you don't have to do so much on, but one, you have to do a lot on. And we're gonna start with the one you have to do a lot on. So we're gonna start with our Beauty and the Beast, or you'll either get Beauty, or you'll get the Beast, or you'll get Aladdin, or you get Jasmine. I'm gonna do Beauty and the Beast, you won't get both. So they all have to be alone, single, like I am. <laughs> all right, here's what we're gonna do. I am gonna go very fast, like the hare in the tortoise and the hare, and I'm gonna color these up. The first thing you wanna do is color these up. Now, if you're a little bit lazy, like I know some of you are, you only have to do the top part. You don't have to do his pants, but you have to do his shoes, and I'll explain why that happens later. But you know what? Just to be safe, I will color the whole thing. Color suggestions are on your sheets. So, the beast is blues and golds. Royal blue, royal, get it? And, of course, Belle is yellows and golds. This is that beautiful gown, the iconic Beauty and the Beast gown. All right, on your mark, get set, go. Boing. We're back. Whew. That took a long time, but luckily we sped it up. Now we're gonna take just as long to cut them out. On your mark. Get set. Go. Boink. Boo! Now you're probably wondering why there are two of Beauty and two of the Beast. It's because this is Doppelganger Week. No, I'm just kidding. You don't have to look up what Doppelganger means. No, it's because they're, if you notice, they're mirror images of each other. So you're gonna put them back to back and glue them, which I'm going to staple them to make things quicker. Ta-da! Because camera woman Monica only has 4% battery left. All right, so we got her. So you put these together, and if you like cutting things out, boy, you're gonna enjoy this because it's a whole lot of cutting. <laughs> I love cutting, Mickey. <laughs> I stapled his armpit. All right. Can you tell him what my favorite Disney character is? All right, so we have Beauty and the Beast. Now, what are these circles for? I don't know, Mickey. Well, we're going to fold them. I would do this like this. Fold them all together in half. And make a tackle. That's supposed to be the tiki head. Okay. Well, Mel, what do we do? Well, we're going to take these, and we've done this once before, if you'll remember, and we're gonna take two sides of the circle and glue them together. 
I am going to staple them. But when you staple them, they don't look as nice. So I'm just doing this to show you. And you take this one, and you try to pick up if they get stuck together. <laughs> and we're gonna go right here. And the next one. And the next one. <gasps> Wait a minute. It's not four. You're gonna do four together. One, two, three. Four. Yes. Okay. That's one side. Oh, I got carried away. I was gonna make a ball. What the beach ball? Yes, I was. Shut up, Goofy. All right. So. You're dumb. Don't, you're not supposed to call anybody dumb, Goofy. All right. So don't be stupid, no, I'm just kidding. All right, so then you can do this one. So four circles on each side stapled together. You almost did too many, I know, shut up. All right. And the last one. All right, then, this is for beauty. I'm gonna use magic to do the beast. All right, so, for beauty's dress, this is why if you're a little lazy or you're just in a hurry, you don't have to really paint the bottom of her dress or color it, because this becomes now her poofy, beautiful, Bowl down. <laughs> so you're gonna glue it to her. I'm gonna stay. Step on my finger. No, I didn't. <laughs> Donald stapled my finger one time to a board. You probably deserved it. All right. So there, that's one side of her gown, but we have two sides. So what are we gonna do? We're gonna make her skirt on the back side too. All right, so here's this. Glue, not staple. You see how, do you see the staples in there? It doesn't look good, but we don't have the time or the battery. All right, so you do this. And then you got a string and you're going to, however you want to do it, you can staple it, you can uh, probably glue it or tape it. I forget what the instructions, the instructions tell you kind of what to do. String. Oh, you can put the string in between the two sides before you glue them together. And that way it's glued in there. But you didn't do that. I know I didn't do it. I'm gonna, since I, since my thing is a staple theme, as I, you know, I'm really good at themes. I'm the one that comes with, up with all the themes for your different things. I'm gonna do a staple. And there we go. It's like a little ornament. You can save it for Christmas. You can hang it from your window. You can throw yours away because it's ugly. It's not that ugly, Goofy. So there you go. Now, with magic, I'm going to put the beast together and Aladdin and Jasmine, and we're gonna see all of them. Bibbity boppity boo. And here we go, the finished project. You'll either get Belle, the Beast, Jasmine, or Aladdin. They have poofy pants, he has a big belly, and she has a full skirt. A whole new world, Beauty and the Beast. Goodbye! <laughs>